A very real fear for women becoming reality once again Saturday morning in Sunset Park, Brooklyn. After a woman walks out of the R train station here at 45th Street on 4th Avenue just before 6 a.m., a man walking several feet behind, appearing to be the same one, police say followed a 28 year old woman at the same time to her apartment building near 44th and 3rd Avenue, made sexual comments towards her while touching himself, then grabbed her around the neck and punched her repeatedly. Repeatedly. Police say this guy then ran away and the woman was taken to the hospital. Thankfully, she physically is okay, but it's another instance of a woman being followed then viciously attacked. And it's why all women's self-defense classes at this Upper West Side Krog Maga studio have been packed recently. More signups in a week than they'd usually get in a month. Going back to the office, the Times Square, and I live on the Upper West Side, taking the subway. So it's really the subway and the platform and the concerns there. Adding to those concerns Friday, that attack where a woman walking into the Queens Plaza station was kicked down the stairs, bashed in the head with a hammer, and robbed by a man on her way home from work. And exactly two weeks ago, Christina Lee was followed into her Chinatown building and stabbed 40 times. This is the weakest part of his grip. The workshop at Krav Maga Experts today was specifically geared towards subway safety to empower these women with new skills. Anybody who walks through that door, even if only, only one hour they've spent on these mats, they leave maybe an inch taller because they've taken some actionable skill that we've given them and they're going to transmit that into their life. So this class right here sold out in under 24 hours. And most of the women that you see here today are here for the first time, committed to learning these new mental and physical skills to use in their everyday life. On the Upper West Side, I'm Jessica Cunnington, News 4, New York.